Well, the late night partying and gunfire and street racing could finally be coming to an end on Lookout Mountain Road. Jefferson County Commissioners are supporting a proposal to close the four mile stretch at night. Denver 7's Claire Lavazorio talked to neighbors who are so relieved. The park itself is closed one hour after sunset to one hour before sunrise, and that includes scenic pullout areas right along Lookout Mountain Road. But signs alone aren't stopping bad behavior. So it has two personalities. During the day, Lookout Mountain draws residents and visitors to explore its beauty. You've got the paragliders possibly sailing through the air. You have climbers using um, Tears of Zion. But at night, Marianne Bunnell with Jeffco Open Space says you see a different side of the mountain. They are consuming alcohol. They are leaving trash behind. We find needles. They are firing firearms. Those bullets land on the Beverly Heights neighborhood below. At nighttime, it turns into Party Avenue. Putting Tom Primozich and his neighbors in the danger zone. You can imagine what that would do to a person. Those are just some of the bullets they found on their driveways. It's changed our quality of life. I don't sleep well at night anymore. I lay awake worrying about when am I going to hear gunfire. Primozich is happy to see the plan for electric gates gaining ground to make Lookout Mountain Road a safer space at nighttime. One gate will be installed near the bottom of Chimney Gulch Trailhead and another at the top of the mountain, blocking off a 4.1 mile stretch at night to vehicles. Pedestrians and cyclists will still have access. While the neighbors we talked to today are supportive of the commissioner's approval, others raise safety concerns during public meetings. The police will have that area of the mountain under control and the spillover is just going to happen to other sides of it outside of the closed area. My only concern would be in terms of evacuation or emergency. Benell addressing evacuation, saying they will be staffed and gates will be opened well ahead of time. The community is pushing for a final plan by June 1st. Well, the time's now because it's critical. Someone's going to get hurt and or worse. Looking ahead, discussions need to be had with county planning and zoning. Work done to design the gates and talks with Excel to hook up power. In Jefferson County, Claire Lavazorio for Denver 7.